click on start menu on your windows type powershell windows powershell run as administrator click on it here you can see now press enable Dash windows optional teacher Please enter. Following this command, we are enable hyperversor on this Windows operating system. Now, follow the next command. Center after getting this pop up, this yes, enter. Now it will restarting our Windows operating system. Hello people and welcome to follow internet. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create Microsoft Azure virtual machine. After open your Azure portal, this is Microsoft Azure dashboard. Click on virtual machine under Azure services. Here you can see create click on it azure virtual machine create a virtual machine hosted by azure click on it under basics project details subscription free trial this is recommended because we are using free trial just you need to sign up if you are worried about how to sign up you can check out our playlist 
now instance details it will take our virtual machine name that you can choose anything in my case Numan RDP here you can see resource group that by default create a group scroll down now scroll down security type click on it standard this image is going to be your virtual machine image that you want to choose you can choose it that you need in my case i want to go with windows 10 pro this is also free services eligible now here you can see size this size is not available in june 1 so we need to change zoom scroll up here you can see availability zone that zone one and check it now we are going with zone two because scroll down here you can see size now you can see here this is also free services eligible it's pretty much okay for now administrator account now you need to create your credential username and password in that case our username numan you can choose password scroll down here inbound port roles click on it select inbound port http https ssh rdp selected that all port are need to run rdp on your windows licensing check it i confirm I have an eligible Windows 10. Now click on next. Discs. A little scroll down. Create and attach a new disk. Click on it. Here size. Change size. Click on it. Default size Microsoft Azure comes with 124 GB that really big amount but I want to go with 128 GB it will take much low price while this price comes from Azure free where you can select 128 GB okay here selected now click on ok now click on next networking our network interface pretty much done we don't need to change anything you can go with default click on next management we don't need to change anything under management now click on next monitoring click on next advanced we don't need to change anything under advanced we don't need to change anything click on next tax it will automatically create an update tag we don't need to change anything click on next review plus create click on it
validation passed here you can see subscription credit apply for this virtual machine for a month is INR this price low because we are size our now we are almost done click on create at the top of the bottom left corner click on it top of the bottom right corner initializing deployment you can see submitting deployment our deployment our deployment is in progress it will take up to five minutes you need to wait okay here you can see now our deployment is complete now click on go to resources go to resource click on it we are created our rdp name noman dash rdp now click on connect scroll down native rdp select click on it here you can see this is validating it will take couple of minutes Okay, we are already configured. Now scroll down, download RDP file, click on it. Numan RDP that we are create now. Now click on file. Here, double click on it. Now check this checkbox, click on connect. Click on more choice, select your account. Use different account. Here, our username that Numan. Here you can see our username Numan and password that we are created. Click on Remember Me. Okay. Here after getting this pop up. Check it. Yes. After getting this prompt, accept, click on it. Welcome to free RDP on Azure Retire. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to learn more, 
you can check out our playlist